ever. That song was played for the entire crew and was performed by Max Q. It was selected by the Comtex and Mission Control. Shuttle Flight Director Gary Horlocker calling uh, on an internal loop to Flight Director Derek Hassman down the hall, giving him uh, permission now to take over the uh, orbiter boom sensor system, giving the uh, handoff permission for that uh, boom to become a permanent component of the International Space Station and essentially effectively be renamed the ISS Boom Assembly. See a beautiful space shuttle there. That's a beautiful endeavor. It really is. She's a great ship. She looks like she belongs right there. Houston Endeavor. Go ahead, Endeavor. On behalf of the STS-134 crew and the Expedition 27 crew, Space Station Assembly is complete. Houston copies. Thank you. Good view of the power and data grapple fixture now installed on what was the orbiter room sensor system and now will be known as the enhanced with this addition, International Space Station Boom Assembly. And a good view here as well of the Destiny Laboratory directly below Shamatov, connected to the Harmony module, which connects the uh, Destiny to the Japanese and European labs, Kibo and Columbus and beyond that Space Shuttle Endeavor. Mission Specialist Greg Shamatov's going to uh, use the camera that he already had out to get a photo of the International Space Station now that it uh, okay. is complete. And as this is the last spacewalk for a Space Shuttle crew, this is a good time to the document the accomplishments of more than 1,000 hours of spacewalking time spent building the International Space Station. Now that's uh, almost done here, what they do, wanted to say a few words. This is the last flight of Space Shuttle Endeavour, and it's also the last spacewalk of, uh, shuttle, of shuttle crew members and for uh, station assembly. Kind of fitting that Endeavour is here, because uh, Endeavour was the first shuttle to begin construction of the station, and so it's fitting that she's here for the last last uh, mission, the uh, finished assembly. And um, during the CBA, we passed both together collectively over a thousand hours of spacewalks uh, as part of uh, station assembly. Right now I have the uh, honor here to share this last spacewalk. And uh, of course, with all the folks working on the ground, thousands of people who helped build us working in the shuttle and the station program, we're floating here on the shoulders of giants. This uh, space station, the pinnacle of human achievement and uh, international cooperation. 12 years of building and 15 countries, and now it's the brightest star in the sky and hopefully the doorstep to our future. So congratulations, everybody, on assembly complete. Well said, Todd. You think it goes? All right, I think it's fun. <laughs> that works. Thank you. All right, time to go home, thanks. There we go. You can see both spacewalkers here making their way back to the Quest airlock on the uh, bottom of the screen in the all-white spacesuit, Mike Fink, making his way hand over hand down the space station's truss. And you can uh, get a look at where Mission Specialist Greg Shamatov was taking his photos from. He's on the uh, express logistics carrier, climbing down from that to the truss. It was at the uh, top of that stowage platform for the photos that he just took of the International Space Station.
Mission Specialist Greg Shanatoff now in the Quest airlock with Mike Fink, the last space shuttle crew member to conduct a spacewalk, now back inside the airlock. Hey Mike, you just closed the hatch on that is successful and safe EVAs for the shuttle program. Yeah, I wanted to uh, say congratulations to the shuttle program for all the wonderful successes we've had past 30 something years and privilege that Endeavor's uh, hosting the last space swap by uh, space shuttle crews. And uh, so congratulations to the EVA development teams who've come a long way. So from me and uh, Greg and the rest of the crew, congratulations.